Hello everyone, how are you all? I hope you're keeping fine and safe in this pandemic situation. And I'm also sure staying at home, you are uh, waiting for the job notifications to be out as to when the notification will be out and you will be able to fill out the form and you can get into your dream job. Yes. So today in this video, I'm going to give you the job notification of PSSSB Recruitment 2021 for election Kanugo post and you can apply online at sssb.punjab.government.in. Any graduate eligible uh, for this SSSB Punjab and if you think you are eligible for this election Kanugo, you can apply for it. The eligible and interested candidates can apply for PSSSB election Kanugo Recruitment 2021 on the official website that is sssb.punjab.gov.in. PSSSB Recruitment 2021 notification has been released by Subordinate Sub, uh, Service Selection Board Punjab, that is SSSB Punjab, and they are inviting online application for the post of election Kanugo. Eligible and interested candidates can apply for PSSB uh, election Kanugo recruitment from 1st July to 19th July 2021 on its official website, that is SSSB. Dot punjab dot gov dot in. Now I'll give you the important dates. The starting date of online application is 1st July 2021. The last date for the submission of the online application form is 19th July 2021 up to 5 p.m. in the evening. Next coming to last date, the last date for the submission of the application fee is 22nd July 2021. Now talking about the PSSSB vacancy details, election Kanugo post has got five posts vacant. For the five posts are for EWS, there are two posts available. For SC, there is one post available. For ESM, there is one post available. For DEF, and hard of hearing, there is one post available. So these are all about the vacancy details. Now about uh, I'll talk about the salary. PSSSB election Kanugo salary will be 29,200 rupees per month. The eligibility criteria for PSSSB election Kanugo, the educational qualification requirement and its details. Firstly, you should be a bachelor holding a bachelor's degree in any discipline from a recognized university or institution. You should have 10th passed with Punjabi. Now coming to how to apply for this desired post that is PSSSB election Kanuku requirement 2021. The students or the candidates eligible and interested can apply for this post through the official website on sssb.punjab.gov.in from 1st July to 19th July 2021. Now talking about the application fee, for general it is rupees 1000, for SC, ST, EWS the fees is rupees 250. For ex-servicemen and dependent, the application fee is rupees 200. For handicapped, the application fee is rupees 500. So this is all about the application fee and its details. PSSSB election Kanuko notification download from, you can do this from PSSSB website. The payment mode is only online. Now I'll give you the job summary. The notification has been released by PSSSB Recruitment 2021 for election Kanugo post and you can apply online at the rate sssb.punjab.gov.in. Graduate and eligible candidates can apply. 
The notification date was 30th June 2021 and the last date for the submission of the application form will be 19th July 2021. For the city, that is the job location will be Amritsar, the state will be Punjab and the country is definitely India. The organization where you are going to work is Punjab SSSB or you can say that is PSSSB board. The educational qualification required is graduate. The functional area is other functional area. So this is all about the notifications. Now I'll give you the instructions. Now instructions for applying online. Now there are few instructions which is released which I'm going to discuss right now. Firstly, candidates have to apply only online on the website https ssb.punjab.gov.in from 1st July 2021 to 19th July 2021 up till 5 pm. New registration as well as form completion or submission shall be closed after this. After getting the online application number, the candidate should upload a scanned a copy of the passport photograph, a recent size passport size photograph, not older than three months. His or her signature, 10th standard Punjabi certificate, qualifying exam certificate to complete the online application form. Otherwise, your application form will not be considered complete. Supported file formats are JPJ, PNG and GLF only. File size should be up to 100 KB only. Please note that applications without uploaded photo and signature will be considered incomplete and will be subsequently rejected. So if you want to avoid rejection, follow the above procedures. The candidates should note that name, father's name, date of birth and category cannot be changed once entered in the application online form. No correction or changes will be allowed after the form have been submitted. So the candidate should fill his or her form very very carefully as there will be no rectifications allowed. On third day after submitting the application form, the candidate shall deposit the fees by logging into the online application portal or the website after 11 a.m. Last date for the submission of the fees is 22nd July 2021. In case the candidate fails to deposit the fee, his or her application stands automatically cancelled or rejected and he or she shall not be considered for further processing. The next step, next day after depositing the fee, the candidates can take a printout of his or her application form which is considered necessary. Candidates are advised to keep this form with them for future use and for further reference. Only online application forms and online payment will be entertained, that is application sent by post or in person will not be entertained in any situation. Any application sent physically to the board shall be summarily rejected and will not be considered for the further processes. The candidates are advised to visit https sssb.punjab.gov.in website regularly for the current updates. Due to any reason, technical or otherwise, if the fee is not paid, the application shall not be considered. So they are very particular about this. For any clarification regarding the online filling up of the form, the candidate can call on all the working days to the phone number that is given in the website 
from 11 from 10 am to 4 pm at sssb punjab government helpline numbers i'm giving here is 0172 229800 extension number is 5106 and 5107 so uh, I have given you and one more extension is there. One more number is there actually. That is 0172-229-8083. So these are the numbers and it's extension that I have given. This is also given in the official website. You can go and check out them. For any technical issues in online application, uh, the candidates can face this. So the candidates can email this to the help. Uh, SPSSSB2110 at gmail.com if you have any problem. The candidates will be responsible for any mistakes made by him or her in the online application form. SSSB Punjab government shall not be responsible or liable in any way for the wrong filling up, filling up of the form. The candidates applying for the advertised post should ensure that they have fulfilled all the eligibility criteria asked for the respective post. Their candidature at any or all stage of the recruitment process will be purely provisional subject to uh, satisfying the prescribed eligibility conditions that is given in the notification. Mere submission of application form will not imply that candidate is eligible for the advertised post. So I have given you all the notifications, the application fee details, all the requirements that is asked by the board and therefore if you consider yourself applicable and in this pandemic situation since this job notification is out, why waste time? All the details have been provided and they are very strict about no rectification being done in the online application. So be very, very, very careful while filling them. Uh, take all your documents uh, that are requi required and then go for filling up this form because no rectification or no correction will be allowed. So if you are filling whatever you are filling it up, the same will be carried on if you are further selected. And they are very, very strict about the candidature process and the selection process. So if you think you are eligible enough, then without wasting time, go for it. Go and grab this opportunity. So all the best for your career ahead. I hope this video has been giving you some value for the job notifications. There will be other videos also with the current job, no, no job notifications, but this is a very good one. So I hope you will go and fill out the application form if you are eligible enough. So all the best for your career ahead. Thank you for patiently watching this video and stay happy, stay home, stay safe. Thank you.